This is Bunny D93. Thank you for tuning in to my channel. Okay, today I'm really just gonna see how much time YouTube is actually gonna give me because they said I have like 20 minutes now. And the last time they told me I had 15, they cut me back down to 10. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Ain't that a joke? <laughs> anyway, we'll see what happens. But yeah, this is my, can you guys see it? My hairstyle of the week. Number two, doll. Whatever the other one is, how you say number two, with my flower. It is the extended mohawk. Do y'all remember me talking about this? Yeah, I think I came pretty darn close to doing that, eh? Don't you think? Yeah. I just did a braid instead of, like, that tail. So, I'm going to show you guys. And, of course, the sides are 27 pieces. This is mainly, like, the three inches and the two inches. And it's probably, like, a one-inch, like up in there somewhere but this is mainly three inch and then when I ran out of three inch I put the two inch up in there so the sides are 27 pieces 1b two and three inches and then the back like from the crown down is a 12 inch by Yaki which is Milky Way this is all Milky Way hair I hope you guys can see that and then the top is a SG 4 inch and it flips like this this is how it lays when it's like not flipped for real so this part is really not flipped but I flipped that you see so I'm gonna stand back and let you guys see this is what it looks like with the tail of course that's the 12 inch and it's just braided it's not perfect doesn't have to be you can fish bone braid it hair bone braid it is what it's really called but it's up to you guys you know, and I just basically from the crown down is all of the 12 inch, but I cut it the same length as the from crown to my forehead, which is the SG four inch wrap by Milky Way. I cut them all the same length. That's all that is. And then right probably about six or seven pieces in the back is just straight hair. It's just straight 12 inch that I did not cut. And all I did was take a, um, I wish I had it. But all I did was take like a white pencil. This is not a white pencil, but this is what I did. And I, I'm going to hurt myself over here. I just sectioned it. I went on my wig cap and marked it off. Did two sections like this from eye to eye. Well, from, from this part of my eyebrow to this part of my eyebrow. That was my section. That's how I sectioned my hair. And on the outside is the 27 pieces. And I just did that all the way down. And then we have the SG4 inch all the way to the crown. And then the rest is a 12 inch. That's it. You can leave your 12 inch. You can cut your 12 inch. You can curl your 12 inch. You can even use a different type of hair right here. And not even put the braid down here. I mean, it's up to you. I just like what I did. I think I came pretty close of doing what I wanted to do. So here you go guys. There will be a picture tutorial either right here or right here, you know, somewhere. But yeah, and this is a wig. So you guys, you know, that's what I do. I can do weave too and natural hair and permed hair, but I like wigs better. For me, they're my preference. This is my little bow, my accessory. But yeah, so I'm going to take this bad baby off and I'm going to show you guys something that I just discovered about my Maybelline um, concealer by Fit Me. I am a number 30. And I was like, let me go in here and try to... I'm taking my wig off, y'all. Just let y'all know. So y'all don't think I'm doing something with my head. But, um, I was like, let me go and try to figure something out. Because, like, I would use it. This is my wig cap. I would use it. And then, you know, this is what it looks like, y'all. I would use that concealer. And then I'd be like, man, why it look like that? Like, basically, it's all how you, it's about your technique of how you do stuff. And, yes, I cut, you know, behind my ears. I don't know if y'all can see that. But it's like a little space right there. That's where my ear goes. And those are my sideburns. And you can raise the hair down on the sides. 
like buzz cut them to get them like even shorter but I never have time to do that and I never want to cut the hair to where it looks stupid and nasty because sometimes people don't know what they be doing with uh with them little buzz cutters and stuff them razors and stuff but if I probably watch my teacher do it my cosmetology teacher do it I'll probably get it but I don't be having time y'all so yeah I am going to wash my face and I'm going to show you how I put my concealer on with my foundation and to see so y'all can see the effect that I get because I was so amazed at myself that I had did that so yeah I was just like oh really and it came out like this <laughs> but right now I'm just putting my scarf on this is what I sleep in sometimes, sometimes I don't, sometimes I really just go to sleep. Because I don't know about y'all, but sometimes I come home after Bible study and I be like, <sighs> I be knocked out. So, and if anyone doesn't know how to do this, all you do is make a triangle, wrap it around your head, pull it back up, tie a knot, then take the pieces that's hanging in front of your face and tie another knot. That is all, y'all. Make sure all the pieces are in there. At least that's all I do. I'm sorry, y'all. My music ain't even playing. CC Winans. Hey, y'all. Go. Yep. There you go. That's how you do that. Alright, I'm gonna wash.